I'm Cher Russell for mining.com.au and joining me today is Terry Lynch, the CEO of Power Nickel. Terry, how are you today? I'm doing great in merry old London, having a, having a nice visit over here. Listen, it's great to have you on uh, and thank you for coming on while you are in London. Uh, but I wanted to talk to you about these outstanding results that have just come out from the Lion Zone as part of your NISC project. Can you talk me through some of the key numbers that I'm looking at? Yeah, we, we uh, announced uh, five all three. Three of them are very good from our perspective, um, you know, ranging from uh, a little over two and almost 2.4% copper equivalent to almost 6% uh, from five meters to 12 meter intersections. So big intersections. Um, and I, I guess it, we were super encouraged because uh, it was actually outside the core zone in what we call the halo area. So uh, to get such great results outside of the, the core zone uh, was super encouraging to us and really means uh, adds a, a, ton, a lot of uh, mineralization to the project, which is uh, ultimately will be important for commercialization. So we were uh, super encouraged and, uh, you know, it was a, was a good first start to the uh, uh, summer program. Uh, what a great way to start your summer program. But I know here in the announcement that it actually says what you're calling the halo zone has effectively expanded the lion zone area by 50%. So what does this mean overall for the lion zone going forward? Yeah, so so uh, the summer program basically uh, uh, outlined, uh, you know, that went deeper and it's gone further, uh, you know, to the uh, west. So uh, adding 50% just uh, obviously increases uh, substantially your, in your mineralized area. And, uh, you know, I think it's just the beginning. This thing has got a lot of legs to it. And, uh, you know, I think it's uh, super encouraging for, for us to see it uh, being so uh, uh, healthy, you know, uh, carrying forward, carrying the grade uh, and uh, carrying the intersections and, uh, you know, at, at ever increasing widths. So, uh, um, you know, as, as these things go, it's a sort of uh, kind of tiger by the tail, as, as you were, you know. Uh, Terry, these kind of results that you're getting out of this project are stunning and many people would be enviable of this polymetallic deposit that you're building. Uh, tell me, what can we look forward to see next and look for basically more good news to roll in? Yeah, you know, I, you know, the, the crazy as it sounds, it's going to get better, <laughs> you know, so, uh, which is sort of, uh, you know, have to pinch yourself because uh, you know, we all know how rare it is to get uh, these types of results. So when you, when you, you know, when you're in the zone and you're, and you're clicking, your drill bed is working, you know, tremendously like it is for us. It's uh, super encouraging. And, and, and uh, yeah, so we're going to be bringing out, uh, uh, I think this was probably our worst set of uh, assays for the summer. And uh, they'll get better as we go forward. So uh, uh, look forward, forward to bringing that to the uh, shareholders and uh, hopefully to a wider shareholder audience. Uh, well, Terry, the drill bit continues to deliver here for the Lions, Lion Zone and for Power Nickel. Thank you for speaking with me today, and I can't wait to see what you guys dig up next. Thanks so much for being here. All right. Thanks again. Ciao for now. Bye.